All right, pretty excited. Got the new Camus 40. We got a weather window in Northern Abacos. That's where we're going to head. Got a group of guys that's going to meet us over there. I got my buddy Jackson running over with us right now. So who knows what we're going to catch? Tuna, marlin, mahi, do some diving. It's going to be an adventure, I promise you. Our plan was to run along and look for birds in hopes of finding yellowfin tuna underneath them, but at the same time we're always scanning the surface looking for any kind of floating object. This is just an opportunity that you can't pass up anytime you see something floating. You have to take the time, you have to stop, and you have to give it a couple casts. Oh, oh my! Yeah! Dinner! Dinner! Oh, oh, wait, 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 it's like the last time we fished together! George! Mess me up! You want gaff him? He's a little slinger. Anybody with him? Huh? Anybody else with him? You wanna play with him? Hey, Mahi. Come on, there's gotta be some more in there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, right there with him. Right there with him. Oh, he's all lit up. Look at that. Baby. Oh, I got him on the Yuzuri! Your own, buddy. Oh, nice. I the oh my god, look one. at the wall! There's oh. another one! Here they come! This is what happens when you're in the Bahamas. <laughs> get another one, Jackson. Get that little pug. Yeah, that's that little tiny thing. Oh yeah, throw that in there. Oh, there's a good one right there. Yeah. Whoa! Nice. Why are you doing little circles? That's why you always have one of those poppers tied on. Tied on. Damn, Marlon got that center? <laughs> the nice thing about having dive doors. And poppers. Oh God, oh, oh, get in the boat! Whoa, that would hurt. Oh boy, we're making a mess. Oh, he's gonna jump out of the boat! Oh, oh. <laughs> he shut the door on my fish! Sorry, buddy. I'll help you. I'll help you land him. Watch out. We got dinner. 
We got enough for a fish fry. And a show. Nice little double mahi. Right out of the gate. Gotta be ready for anything out here. Chasing the yellow fin and that didn't work out, but you know what? Not a bad alternative. Nice job, buddy. Way to do it. Woo! A little messy, not too bad. Woo! I got a couple friends coming over to join us, Kyle and Greg. Both have a ton of experience fishing here in the Bahamas. They love to tuna fish. You know, Jackson and I on this 40 foot boat is just not enough. You can get in these schools of tuna, every rod can go off, so more hands the better. All right, it's our first morning at uh, Grand K. Jackson, who joins me on all these trips. Kyle, his buddy G. I affectionately refer to him as G, but it's Greg. Uh, so. You money. We're gonna run up to the northwest, look for a color break, look for some tuna, troll some stuff around. You never know up here. These guys, you guys normally fish the channel, right? That's your thing? Yeah, down south. We're from further further south than you, so channel generally. But most of the guys are running over here looking for yellowfin, especially this time of the year. So it's a great time of the year to do it. You know, blue marlin, big mahi, you know, there's some wahoo being caught right now. And not even talking about the diving and the inshore species as well. So we're gonna Obviously, it's pretty dark out right now. We're going to make the run, run the radar, run the FLIR. How far are we going? 30 miles? Probably about 30, yeah. Started about 30 miles and hopefully get that big one, big yellow sickles. Well, a few of them. Let's do it. You got a bait out, Kyle? Yeah. All right. Naked ballyhoo. Yeah. I mean, it's first thing in the morning. It's the first pack of birds we found. There's a little surface action right here. I'm trying to get in front of these fish. Big thing up here is driving. You got to get in front of them. Birds are moving. Fish are moving. You got hit. Ooh, little guys there. It might be too small. It might be a little black fish. I'm bit. I'm bit. We're on. I'm bit. I'm bit. That didn't take long. Woo! Top of the morning to you. We're bit, boy, let's go. Y'all gotta put some out, G. Let's Come on, go. put a bait out. He's got a little weight to him. Oh, Does he? Yeah, a little bit. Oh, they're jumping back there. Look at them getting, look at them. Yeah. All right, meet. <laughs> why we came. Good job, guys. You bet, <laughs> come on, baby. Oh, he's on you, he's on you, he's on you, he's on you, he's on you. He's on you. <laughs> First flock of birds right off the bat. I love it over here. Looks like blackfin maybe. You can't do this every, you can't do this anywhere else. Yeah. That's it, man. This is a place to be in the spring. Oh, there's a nice fish airing out over there. Big one. Yeah, not a monster, but it's a good start. Getting close, George. All right, working on a gap, yeah. stand by. Got color. You got the gaff? Yep. That's a decent fish. 
We'll take that one. That's the red color, George. Woo! Oh, don't let him take you in the water, boy. God, dog. Get him in the boat. He almost took you for a ride. <laughs> Woo! Oh, yeah, yeah man, boy. Man. That's why we came. That's it. He almost pulled you in. That's why you make the ride here. We got Good job, boy. Woo! Nice Good work. job. Nice work. We'll take that. He ate that thing probably three different times. Oh, he jacked my arm up. He sure did. He thought pulled your ass in. Oh, I wasn't letting go. I almost lost my Rolex. That was pretty good. Entertaining. Oh. Yeah, he ate this thing a couple times. Jackson, underneath your feet. You got it? I got you, G. First two baits in the water. God. That's what it's at. Every show was like this. Oh, man. My life, I wouldn't have so much gray hair. He almost pulled you in. You all right? Did it hurt your arm? I beat myself up every day. That's the least of my problems. You used to it by now? <laughs> all right. Here we go. Second bait in the water. First morning out of Grand. This is why we do it. This is why you make the long run. This is why you find the birds what it's about right here. There's the fluoro. Woo! Ah, nice! That one cooperated a little better Look for you. Hey guys, Captain George Gods, host of Unfathom, full-time fishing guide, and a Mercury Pro staffer. Today I want to talk to you about some basic rules of navigation. There's red markers and green markers, and what do these mean? A simple acronym to remember is when you're coming in from offshore, red is on your right. Red right return. Another thing that you're going to see a lot of is slow speed zones, idle zones, uh, you know. Idle speed is the slowest navigational speed that you can go to keep your boat underway, under steerage. Slow speed, faster than idle speed, but again, it's a minimum wake. Slow speed, boat has to be settled in the water. Also, there's you know certain zones, especially in the coastal waterway, that are 25 miles an hour or certain speed limits, and you have to mind those zones as well. Resume normal speed is just that. You have to remember that most accidents occur at higher rates of speed uh, when boating, so you have to be in control of your vessel at all times. And again, docking as well. Slower is always better. You know, don't go any faster than you want to hit the dock. Slower is better. So just follow these basic navigational rules. Familiarize yourself with local waterways, and that'll keep you safe on the water. You bit? Oh, look at it back there. Oh, another one right, right long, left long. Left long, left long, Kyle. See if he comes back on that belly here. Mono, wait, wait, wait. Did you bring us just for the muscle or are you going to get in here? Oh, I got one. Oh, you got one on oh, too? Both We're triple, tripled up? You Gee, you got up. one? Yeah! <laughs> tripled up. That's right. I'll get you. You good? Let me get it out of your way. Oh, I just got bit at the ball. What the? Look at that. Oh, my God! I just got bit at the ball. <laughs> George trying to get another one up there, bro. What are you gonna do? We got four, we got four on, but we only got three people. <laughs> Coming to the Bahamas, especially springtime, these fish are migrating through. You know, I'll, I'll show you guys later on the fish mapping. You can see a cold water edge where the cold water and warm water push together. That's the edge we're working right now. God, he's—I can see him down there. That's a good fish. 
And uh, these packs of birds, we're just running radar, finding packs of birds. It's a decent one, right? Yeah, he's better. He didn't want to come up. Now he is. There he is down there. Look at the color down there. You got color? Yeah, yeah. He's over on this side now. He's over on this side. Eighth of Yozuri. Oh, boys! Nice one. No! Don't let him take it. <laughs> there you go. There you go, George. Yeah! That's a fish. That's a good one. <laughs> a better class fish. Oh, yeah. Better class fish here. Ate that thing right at the boat. That was, that was one of the most epic bites I've ever seen. Kicking on the surface, kicking up a wake. It's a Yuzuri Bonita. Look at these. Yeah, that thing. <laughs> Crushed it. 15 feet off the boat. That was wow. epic. Beautiful. Oh. They taste pretty good too, I heard. Awesome. This is why we come to the Bahamas, right here. winter for for this you don't get a lot of weather windows but when the window opens you gotta go nice fish nice fish nice fish boys good fish we're still in them man we are still in them boys that's it there we go Woo! oh yeah oh. good job yeah, boys. Boys. That's what we come here for. Ready? Woo! Got a nice one, boy. Oh Let's do it again. I'm not done. That school apparently still has some big fish in it, boys. There's some wahoo under there for sure. Some kind of net, right? Mahi, big Mahi, right here, right here, round front. Oh, 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 let him in! Oh, oh got him, got him! Woo! Woo! Watch your line, watch your line. Woo! I dropped the jig down and got bit. Is that a wahoo? Ha wahoo, baby! Johnny's jigs got it done. There you go, right in the head. Nice work. Yeah. Look at that. A little variety out here today. You never know. And you got a mahi in the background. And a mahi. Nuts! He pulled the hook? Right there, G, off the corner. See him? He's going after my papa right now. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, oh got him! Got him! Oh, 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 he's fish. tight! You can't even gaff him, he's tight! <laughs> you can't stop the boat around here, you get tight. Oh, I got another fish on the jig. <laughs> Who's on gaff duty, G? Where you at? Uh, I need a little love. Yeah, I got you. 
Oh, I pulled it. I'll give him another turn. Nice fish. Oh, he's there we doing go. a turn there. I'm so afraid of these hooks on the popper here. Right in the head. All right, we'll take it. Look at that. There is no prettier fish in the ocean. Talk about color, look at that thing. first day of fishing out of Grand Cay in the northern Abacos of the Bahamas was nothing short of remarkable. Non-stop action, more than we could ever have hoped for. The weather window opened up and it looks like it's going to stay open for a couple more days. We have the crew and the boat, we have the tackle and the bait. There's no reason we don't stay. These opportunities don't present themselves often. We gotta stay, we gotta get back out here and see what else this place has to offer. Ending to a great day. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's get him in the box. 